I rescued him. I was coming out of the Dollar General when I saw people throwing him out of the car and driving away. I stood there, not understanding what was happening. He started running after the car, trying to catch up with them. Then I thought, wait, no, I need to go get him. At first, he hesitated to come with me, but I managed to grab him and take him home. He looked well taken care of, with a shiny coat and trimmed nails. I guess they didn't want him anymore. We took him to the vet for a checkup, but there was no microchip. We posted pictures of him on social media, but no one reached out. In the first few days, he just slept. For two days, he curled up on the floor on a rug in our bedroom and slept. He was very nervous and would panic if we stepped away at all, as if he feared being abandoned again. He's still a very anxious dog, holding onto his pillows and making that little cat motion with his paws. He still has triggers. When he sees certain people or images, he starts barking, so we try to avoid specific individuals. Although he looks like a teddy bear, he is an anxious teddy bear. It took a good week for him to allow us to put a harness on him and to be able to walk him outside, treating him like a normal dog. I think having other dogs in the house made it a bit easier, as it helped him feel more comfortable and gave him some confidence. He is amazing, I don't know how to describe him, I can only say he is full of love. He adores our kids and the other dogs. He has a crazy personality and will snatch your shoe and run off, prompting you to chase him around the house. He is a completely different dog now. I'd say he's like a person, but he's just a transformed dog. He's a cuddle bug who, if he could, would burrow into your skin. With his big floppy ears, petting him is very therapeutic. He wants to be where you are, so if you're doing chores, he's right there with you. When I'm loading the dishwasher, he's licking the dishes. He loves to lay on me, and whenever I sit anywhere, he comes right into my lap. I can't imagine waking up in the morning and not finding him there, snoring in my face. I don't know what happened in his past life, but now he is so loved.